Welcome to our heavenly space. Take the load off. You know the burden brick you have been carrying. Lay it here. Allow us to fill you with peace you are needing and help equip you to maneuver through this physical world and help you to fill your pages in your book of life that God gave to each one of you. You know the man you see stretched out on crosses? His name is Jesus Christ. He is God, the creators of the world's beloved Son. His name is Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ fought for our life by paying our sin debt in full. Yes, Jesus Christ died for you. Yes, for you and I and your family. You are truly loved. Not sure if you knew that. The category for today is imagery. And the title is, Are You the Child God Gave the Skill to? Imagery is a session where we speak on a topic and we ask that you create a mental picture or if you are a painter, we ask that you paint the topic. Then we will ask you to meditate on the picture or the painting you created. Please make yourself comfortable. And you're more than welcome to close your eyes if you prefer. Let us begin. It is a light blue sky with dark green trees far in the distance. Brown farm acres with a traveling road alongside of it. Then on the other side of that traveling road is another green pasture, very bright green, and a wooden fence made with leftover poles. And then on the other side of that fence is another green field. Possibly maybe even more of a backyard. And it has a rainbow of flowers in the garden. Yellow, pink, peach, with a bit of greenery of flowers, leaves coming up in between those flowers. And beside that garden is a large cast iron garden decor. Then we go back to that traveling road and there's two vehicles on that road. And the vehicles look like they are pulling horses in the back. This view is so beautiful. It's probably been taken by someone that was on a porch. Because in that garden where the flowers were, there was grass and some potholes where it's missed patches of grass. So maybe the children were playing out 
there. I'm sure, God, the view looking down is just as beautiful from your throne. And the area seems to be so quiet. There looks like there's no human in sight. other than the two people driving those vehicles. Yet, so calm and peaceful. Truly, it must be another postcard picture from your picture album, God. And of course, you had to have one of your child's learn how to take this beautiful picture. Are you one of God's talented child that takes pictures? Now that we finished the topic, I would like you to Meditate on the mental picture that you created or the painting. And focus on it. Now, for those that have closed their eyes, you now can open them. And thank you. Now it is time to dial God. How? We start with the sign of the cross. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Jesus, help remind us of your love and provide us with your love. As well, increase our faith and hope. Provide us with all the food we will need for today. Along with giving us health and strength Also provide us wisdom, which we ask in faith, and everything we will need for today. Amen. We have a message for two birthdays today. Happy birthday to Ray and Tanya. Have a God-blessed birthday to each one of you today, on your birthday, and always. We have one birthday prayer, which is combined with two birthdays. Let us begin with the sign of the cross. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, amen. God bless Ray and Tanya today on their birthdays. Pour in many blessings that overfill and run into every area of each of their lives. We ask this through Jesus' broken body and through Jesus' bloodshed. In Christ Jesus' name, amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, amen. Jesus, we ask that you 
tend to all these prayers. And as well to all our listeners and our viewers for their silent prayers. We place them all in your hands, Jesus. I ask this through Jesus' broken body, through Jesus' bloodshed, in Christ Jesus' name. Amen. We ask all listeners and viewers to go to part two, titled, Are You the Child God Gave the Skill to? We are going to find out what God is telling us for today through the instruction book of life, the Bible.